Welcome back. It's your boy Fresh. And I'm Mary, and we are a co-op of nerds. And today we are going to be unboxing our video games monthly box. For February 2021. Yes. But before we begin, don't forget to give us a like, a subscribe, and follow us on Facebook and Twitter. If you don't know about Video Games Monthly, this is a monthly subscription service where you can sign up for any of the retro systems um, and they can send you, you can sign up for three, four, five, or ten games a month. Mm -hmm. After they send you your games though, you do have to update your library with them so that they don't send you duplicates. That's right. So for this, we got the Retron 5 package, so Famicom, Nintendo, Super Famicom, Super Nintendo, <laughs> Genesis, Master System, Game Gear, Game Boy, Game Boy Color, Game Boy Advance, and then we added DS, 3DS. Yes. Now I think we're we're gonna make a change uh, in the future. I'm just I'm tired of updating all these libraries, <laughs> man. I need to. There's not that many libraries because you don't. Have I to have update four them for some, libraries. For, so there's a couple. There's a, yeah. another one you don't have. To so. Yeah. All right, you ready? Do you think there will be a love-based game in here? Because of Valentine's yes. Day? Yes. There aren't really a lot of love-based games. I mean, when you're in combat, right? Like. Well, Mario saves the princess. He doesn't yeah. save her because he's just doing his job. His well, job, yeah, he is. His job is to unclog drains. He's saving her because he loves her. And he... And that's, I mean, that's what heroes do, though. They save people just because. No. He's <laughs> trying to get a piece of that. <laughs> <laughs> so, are you ready? This game, or uh, this box feels heavy. Feels heavy and rattly. So. But it's not, like, bulky. It's not, like. Yeah. So, on one hand, I feel like there's a bunch of handhelds. And on the other hand, maybe there's a bunch of trinkets. Those are my two guesses. See, you ready? I'm ready. Okay. Show me what you got. It's stuck shut. Maybe they put bricks in it. I think they did. Okay, here we go. Bubble wrap. Bubble wrap, J Lo. First game is a disc base game. We don't have a disc base system. This is a disc base game. Mm. Right? No! <laughs> oh, this is the movie! This is the movie! That's awesome. Even though wow. the movie did like horribly, I don't care. I like Super it. Super Mario Brothers, the movie, the DVD. I think that's awesome. Sealed in shrink wrap. I don't care. I don't care how cheesy it is to you. It's like, it's just, it holds a special place in my heart because they made Mario into a movie. You know, I, I almost think. And this is just my own conspiracy theory. I haven't done any research at all. I almost feel like they had this reptile versus ape movie and thought, well, we really want to do a Mario movie. Let's kind of throw them... Because like, they don't totally line up. It can't be like King Kong versus Godzilla. Right. That's kind of what this movie is. Yeah, but it's got Mario. It's nostalgic. Mario, Mario, and Luigi, Mario. Yes. That is cool. I don't. That has to be the trinket then. Yeah, that's awesome though. That's a really awesome. Yeah, trinket. I don't think I. That's have that. not just a keychain or a pen. That's a movie. Yeah, we will so. watch it. Win three games. Post your box to social media. The conspiracy <gasps> still goes. Hey, we got the double up. Yeah. So there's gonna be. So that's why the box was so heavy. There's gonna be if two they add a movie, games. we got five games plus two, so that's gonna be eight things in this box. Okay, are you ready? That is cool. I am this ready. This one feels like Famicom. Okay. Ooh. Dragon Buster. 
I haven't heard of the game, but look at that. Cart. Dragon Buster. Is that? The gold Zelda style cart. Yeah, but dude, that, that looks like a naked robot. If robots could be naked. Aren't all robots naked? Yeah, but like this is like a level of naked that's like, it kind of looks like it's got human. I think it's a statue. Okay. So it's not a robot or. I think. I think it's a statue. I think it's a fantasy and a statue. So, okay. swords and robots don't typically go together. <laughs> that looks awesome, though. That gold cart. Look at that. That's beautiful. I don't. I didn't know there's any other gold carts besides. I guess uh, are we counting this one in the rankings? No. Okay. That's the extra. So this next one feels like Sega. Ooh, I love Sega. I was wrong. Super Famicom. Okay. Super Dante. But I guess is all are all the Super Famicoms rounded like that? Mm-hmm. Hmm. I guess it's Super Dante. Well, it has like RPG. RPG. JJ. Pi. I don't know. That looks like the Pi symbol. JJ Pi. I don't really know. <laughs> Super Dante. Ooh. Man, they're hitting us with some two Famicom games I have not heard of. I gotta go gold card. Those are handheld. Okay. This one's uh, Advance. Okay, that's the smallest. Yeah, Advance. Okay. Star hey, you're right. Wars The New Droid Army. Hmm. Is that the. That's. The uh, second movie? Yes. Droid Army. I think the third one he had long hair. This one he's got like the rat tail on the side. Yep. I thought about doing a rat tail on the side. What do you think? You know, I used to have a rat tail. How? It's just a curl. <laughs> but yeah, it looked like a pigtail because it was so curly. Yeah, because our, so our daughter's cause... hair is almost completely down her back and yet it, it boings up to her shoulders because of how curly it is. Mm -hmm. So, uh, and she gets that from you. So it was long enough for me to put it in my mouth, but it wouldn't touch my shirt. Why did you put it in your mouth? Because I was the, like Why eight. did you put a hair in your mouth? I was like eight years old, and I used to wear a Rambo shirt. I'll have to find that picture. Rambo shirt and a rat tail. What's more eighties than that? <sighs> I'm getting it. I'm growing it back. Nintendo. Nintendo. Okay. Ooh. Ghosts and goblins. Whoa, that's a. You want to talk about NES hard? That is NES hard. Is it? Oh god, that's a brutal. You gotta beat it twice. You get all the way to the end of it, beat the final boss, and he says, "Ha ha, this was just a figment of your imagination. <laughs> you gotta do it again." <laughs> <laughs> I've never made it anywhere near that far. Because I, I didn't have an NES growing up, so I, I played mainly on the arcade or, you know, later in life, so I didn't really get to grind it. But that game is tough. Two hits and you're dead. Start over. Well, that's how all the classic games are. Oh. Here's another it's NES a, it's game. It's a good game, but tough. Another NES game. Ooh. Galaga? Hey, look at that. Huh. Galaga. Wow. Oh man. I love my shooters. I gotta get that NES Max, man. That's a turbo controller. That's a heavy hitter. I, I don't think it's a rare game, but just near and dear to my heart. I think my dentist had that in growing up it in was like office. a it was like a <laughs> one of those table arcades. Where you kind of sit at, and okay. you could play, I think it was two players, and I think the screen flipped when it was in a person's turn. I was sitting there playing that. I spent a lot of time in the dentist growing up. So, that, that is, it was like, the dentist sucked, but you had a Galaga machine, so. 
<laughs> so it made it worse. Made it better. <laughs> so this next one is uh, what's the what's the handheld Sega? Game Gear. Uh, maybe. It's probably okay. a Game Gear. No. This is a Game Boy Color. Game Boy Tom Color. and Jerry. Why do I feel like we already have Tom and Jerry? We have another Tom and Jerry. No, that was... Why do we have a Tom and Jerry game? I thought it was Sylvester and Tweety. We do, but I also the thought there was a Tom and Jerry one. Twubble? Yeah. Asking for Twubble or Asking something? Asking for Twubble. Tom and Jerry on the Game Boy Color. You can tell it's Game Boy Color because it's got the clear case. Yeah. Or you can see the inside. Yeah, that's a late 90s thing. <laughs> this next oh, one is God. also a Game Boy Advance. That's okay. tough. Another Game Boy Advance game. Okay, that's nice. Ice Age. Hey. Wow, has Ice Age been around that long? You're old. I've been telling you that. Ice Age. That's it. That's it? Yeah, that's seven games. Okay, yeah. What do you think of my order? Looks good. I thought about switching these two, but... No. No? No. All right. We, we have not been showing handhelds a lot lately. I gotta say, before we do this order, this box is phenomenal. <laughs> that, that was awesome. Um, two great classic NES games. Two... Famicom games that I'm super eager to try out, so uh, we'll let you know. So, from least excited to most excited, Tom and Jerry. I loved that cartoon when I was growing up. Me and my brother watched it all the time because we were so much like Tom and Jerry. Which one were you? I was probably uh, Jerry. Jerry, so yeah. Jimmy was always hurting himself? Mm hmm. Okay. Um, I might get some heat for this. Star Wars and New Droid Army. I'm just judging that based on, I guess what, it's, I think it's chapter two. Or episode, episode two. Episode two. That movie was, that was probably the worst one, I think. I like all the Star Wars movies. I'm saying, it, I'm, I didn't say it was bad, I said it was the worst one. So, and we'll go with Ice Age. If nothing else, our daughter will like that. And she does have a pink DS. Yes. And DS plays advanced games. The regular DS does. Yes, it does. Ah, oh, man. Ghosts and Goblins. RPG JJ Pie. <laughs> <laughs> Super <laughs> Dante. <laughs> Dragon Buster and Galaga. Yes. Gotta get that turbo controller, man. Yep. I don't know if that one will let you hold it down or not. Turbo controller will fix it all. Well, that'll do it. I wonder if everyone's getting Super Mario Brothers. I think that'd be a lot of sealed copies of Super Mario Brothers. Yeah, it wasn't a super popular movie, though. Right, so why would they make that many DVDs? Maybe they ordered them. <laughs> they ordered it before they sold the box office receipts? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe it was re-released. Well, that'll do it for this video. We'll see you next time. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye. Bye. Hey, Pumpkin. Yes? Do you wear the same shirt every day? Yes. <laughs> I'm a mom. I don't have the opportunity to expand my wardrobe. Not like me, this shirt is clearly different from the last one. <laughs> and I'm still drinking the same beer from four <laughs> days ago. <laughs> Brew Dog, Elvis Juice, hit me up.